What's going on YouTube? I'm coming at you with my first video here. It's a quick unboxing of the Nike Cortez Kenny 1. I got them on January 26th of 2018 on the sneakers app. That's the only place they released on. And as usual, they ship pretty quick. Got them on order them on Friday, got them the next Wednesday. You know, no problems with shipping, but without further ado, let's get into the shoes. Shipping is always really nice with Nike sneakers app. You know, they should give you the release, the uh, I mean the return address label in case you don't like them. Um, I've ordered the Dornbecker, Dorn, some Dornbecker shoes before, and just great shipping. Okay, so this is how they come in the box. It's pretty nice. I've ordered some Yeezys before and they just throw them in there, no bubble wrap. Here we have some typical bubble wrap. And then they give you the order confirmation. I'm gonna try to cover this up. But they give you a return mailing thing if you don't like them anymore, that's pretty cool. And then they give you the shoes and these look pretty good, all right. So, here's the box, pretty nice, nice and basic, just says damn on it for Kendrick Lamar. The front of the box, I got a size 10 and a half, um, I'm not planning on keeping these, although I am a size 10 and a half, but usually the resale sizes are, you know, 12, 12 and a half, 13, 11, but I thought, hey, I know these are limited, I know it's going to be tough to get them. I'm just going to go for a size that maybe won't sell out right away. So here they are, Cortez Kenny 1, pretty nice metal ring here, but you can already see it's already chipped on the top. That kind of sucks, but hey, that's fine. The box has like a, kind of like a, a weird feel. It's not your regular cardboard. Oof. That's pretty cool. Okay, they got some really nice paper. This is the coolest paper I've seen by far. We'll get into that in a second. And wow, here they are. So here's the shoe. Doesn't come tied. Kind of a surpriser there. As you can see, it's like stitched kind of, and it says damn right there. A metal, like little, not a lace lock, but I guess you could kind of call it that. There's the front of the shoe. Back of it just says Nike on it, nothing too special. Other side, just the swoosh. And actually, these are kind of dusty, not gonna lie. Inside the shoe just says Nike. Tongue, I don't know if you can see that, it says damn, but I don't know, pretty squishy, looks like these could crease really quickly, so be careful there, not bad, even some silver staining on the sole already, that's Great, these are just brand new out of the box and this is already what's happening. Wow. As for the other shoe, could be in better condition. We'll see. It's not. <laughs> also untied, which I've really never seen with the Nike shoe. Little, not flawed, just not the best quality actually. The leather feels pretty nice. Even on the insole it says, it says Nike Cortez. Preferably wear with short, with shorts and tall socks. That's kind of cool right there. It says it right in there. Um, once again, stitching with dam. Not bad. I don't know, they smell good. <laughs> Not a bad shoe. I will be reselling these. Currently the resale price on StockX is around 320. It was at like 450 the day of the drop. 
and then now it's just kind of plummeting down so we'll see if I'm gonna hold these for a little bit or resell them I know these are kind of similar to the Travis Scott Nike shoes the Air Force Ones so they could rise in price as well but just to get in a first look I mean would you wear these let me know in the comments I I know some people go crazy for these, but I mean, yes, it's a collaboration with Nike, but it's, it's not bad. The midsole is kind of like a rubber. The black is a little squishier right there. It's squishier than the white for sure, a little cushioning. But the rest of the shoe is just nice, nice leather, I'd say. Very good quality there. Looks like you didn't push in the insole all the way, I don't know. And then the very, that metal part right up there, it says Cortez 72. Not entirely sure what that means, but if someone knows, let me know. But besides that, cool shoe. I'm not keeping these, gonna have to resell them. But if you like this video, drop a like. Might do some other videos like this in the future. Um... Yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching. Yeah, yeah. Hey, I remember syrup sandwiches and crime allowances. But that's a nigga with some counterfeits. But now I'm counting this. Parmesan with my accountant lives in.